Let us learn how clouds are formed. Take a glass half filled with water. Wipe the glass from the outside with a clean piece of cloth. Add some ice into the water. Wait for one or two minutes. Observe the changes that take place on the outer surface of the glass. From where do water drops appear on the outer side of the glass, the cold surface of the glass containing iced water, cools the air around it, and the water vapor of the air condenses on the surface of the glass. The process of condensation plays an important role in bringing water back to the surface of Earth. How does it happen, as we go higher from the surface of the Earth, it gets cooler. When the air moves up, it gets cooler and cooler. At sufficient heights, the air becomes so cool that the water vapor present in it condenses to form tiny drops of water called droplets. It is these tiny droplets that remain floating in air and appear to us as clouds. It so happens that many droplets of water come together to form larger sized drops of water. Some drops of water become so heavy that they begin to fall. These falling water drops are what we call rain. In special conditions, it may also fall as hail or snow. Thus, water in the form of vapor goes into air by evaporation and transpiration, forms clouds, and then comes back to the ground as rain, hail or snow. Thank you.